Snappers, Snappers, this is Toy Murder the Great. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy. Today, we have completed um, all of the re little sections off of the Rock Village lobby. So we've got Lost Precursor City done, Bangy Swamp done, Precursor Basin done, and all of them we have 100% completed all of their orbs as well. So uh, we're ready to head on. There's nothing more for us to do here today, so we're going to kick it off. Um, head over to Kira here, give us, give her the power cells that we've collected in order to power uh, the Sage's levitation device so that we can go uh, have a little bit of a boss battle, I think, if I remember correctly. Let's, uh, there we go. Great! You have the cells for the machine! They ought to provide enough power to lift that boulder! There we go! Alright, there goes the boulder. Facing that monster lurker at the top. Wait! Uh, I'll stay here and protect Kira. Jack, I think you're ready to handle that monster without me. Oh, really, Heroica? <laughs> Alright, Kira's got it levitating there. So, all we need to do is head up here and take on the monster. Um, this is, again, going to be kind of like in the uh, Forbidden Jungle, a pretty typical boss battle in that you have three phases and stuff like that. If, so far as I remember, it's been a while since I've gotten... Uh, e even in the playthrough I did a little while ago, I don't think... I ma no, I did. I made it further than this, I guess. So I've, I've battled this guy in the last couple of years, I guess, but... I've played a lot of games since then, so I don't really remember. But um, basically, I think it's a lot of jumping around and uh, and some other other kinds of things. Let's uh, let's give it a go, shall we? Right. So he throws boulders at us, and we kind of have to dodge them. Oh no! I predicted that one wrong. Okay. Okay, so then we grab a little bit of eco, builds us a bridge that we can use to get to him here. And we shoot him with all kinds of yellow eco, drops a boulder on his head, and that boulder is now going to uh, Indiana style, to s Indiana Jones style, destroy uh, the platform there. And we, uh, we do it all over again. <laughs> so... <laughs> Let's see, we made it through phase one okay. We took a little bit of damage, unfortunately. So hopefully, as things get more difficult here, we'll be able to... Uh... Oh no, that's not gonna work. Oh, okay. Kicked it up a notch there. Okay, let's get our lava bridge back going, which has since been uh, partially destroyed. Oh, did not make that jump. Gosh darn it. Okay. <laughs> let's uh, let's try this again. Didn't make that jump. We gotta make sure we don't lose any health in this first round because honestly we shouldn't lose any health in this first round and we're probably gonna need it. Uh, probably gonna need it again in the future. So we'll, uh, we'll dodge the slow boulders here as we've done and uh, he's nice enough to give us a little bit of eco there. So we'll do this again. Dodging as we go. And then we'll oop, nope, aim at him. There we go. And we'll shoot him as he generates a boulder here. And put him down a bit. Alright. There we go. Back where we were. Quick and easy. Alright. So we got a, we got three platforms here. I was kinda of jumping just between the two of them on the last round. Uh, we can go to the left as well, which might help us a bit. An eye on where those are going. Because he's not necessarily aiming at us, as you guys saw there. He's shot two boulders at an empty platform. Okay, that one had some eco in it, I'm guessing. Yep. Perfect. Alright, now. That yellow eco going. See if we can't knock him out one more time. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. He's out. And we are ready for round three. All right. Yeah, the big warrior guy probably would have needed to be a little more agile to defeat this guy. Yeah. Oh gosh. 
Oh no! Oh gosh! I pressed the wrong buttons! Oh no! Okay, uh... I'll bring you guys back when we get back to round three. I accidentally rolled jumped off of that one as opposed to jump roll. That's the whole thing. Okay, I'll bring you guys back. Alrighty guys, round three. Let's see if we can't manage to beat him. Uh, as long as we can avoid throwing ourselves into lava, we might be able... Oh, he predicted that jump. Darn it. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Whew. We made it. We made it. If we can avoid dying here. That oh we're not going to though. Oh gosh. Oh wow. Okay. Alright, I was not convinced that we were gonna make it across that bridge without getting hit once. So that's exciting. I think I think that's it. Yes! We get a power cell! Whoo, doggy! We got him! We did it, guys! <laughs> Great. Oh. The people of Rock Village are breathing a collective sigh of relief. But there's no time to celebrate. Use your zoomer to navigate the mountain pass up ahead. Be careful. It looks like the lurkers have rigged the whole pass with explosives. When you reach the volcanic crater, be sure to visit the Red Sage's lab and activate the teleport gate so that Father and I can join you. All right, Kira. So yeah, we defeated the uh, the mid game ish boss, uh, and uh, now we have to go through another zoomer pass uh, that's going to take us to the next section of the game, mountain pass. Okay. So if I does this power cell we just got fall into mountain pass defeat claw. All right. So his name is Claw. Okay, great. And there's three other ones to get. Um, probably well, one is Scout flies for sure. And then the others are, are yet to be determined. But we got more of these uh, flying dudes. Those lurkers must be headed for a detonator at the end of the canyon. If they reach it before oh, no. you, they'll blow up the entire pass. You've got to beat them there and destroy the detonator, or it's all over. Or it's all over. Okay, let's head up here. Oh, gosh. Scout fly. All right. Um, yeah. It'd be preferable if they didn't blow up the entire pass, uh, given that I have a lot of power or precursor orbs I need to get out in here. Oh, I think I missed that scout fly. I'll have to come back and do this <laughs> some other time as well. Assuming. Oh, gosh. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> oh, the joys of video games. All right. Do, 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 do. Well, let's try and clean up the uh, scout flies we missed uh, so far. Let's see. Uh, in fact, let me. I took that higher pass that time. Let me make sure that there's nothing we needed to grab down here. Uh, nope. Did not appear that we missed anything, so that works out. Head up this way. I wonder if I can like destroy these guys like I could the other ones. No, doesn't seem like it. Okay, okay, a little fast, a little fast, a little fast, a little fast. I want to go over the edge. Okay. Ooh, buddy. All right. Beat him through the tunnel. <laughs> okay. Oh no. Oh yeah. No, that was. I thought we could go around that side, but it was looking kind of narrow. Looking kind of narrow. Whoops, didn't come back in time. All right. Not a big deal. Mountain pass. Yeah, see, that jet of Blue Eco probably would be useful because we're not in a real tight place at that point, so we could probably afford it. Yeah. Way out in the lead now. Take that, lurkers. I have an engine. You fools are getting exercise. Suckers? Yes! Oh! 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 <laughs> oh, I'm not good with these driving ones. Just wait till we get to Jack 2, guys. There's a fair bit more driving in Jack 2. Uh, and, uh, yeah! Well, the regular driving... There's a couple of races that we have to do in Jack 2 that I are, are going to be bad. I'll have to cut out a lot of stuff there, I'm sure. <laughs> 
Yep, I can feel it already. Yeah, because there are times... Some of those races in Jack 2 is just really... Like, your vehicles are really... So even, like, here at least... Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> even, even, like, here... I mean, at least the vehicle doesn't have, like, damage. Like, if you bump into things. But in Jack 2, they introduce some of that kind of stuff, too. So, like, if you're bouncing off of stuff, it's hurting your vehicle, then you're going slower, and then... I mean, it's, it's really great the kind of updates they made in the game. I actually, Jack 2 is my favorite of the series, but uh, some of that I'm just not real good at. So, we'll be alright, though. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That was almost really bad. Oh, gosh, that tree is almost the death of me every time I come through here. I need to avoid that in the future. on the dynamite okay and we can come back through here again so I'm going to just kind of try and beat the race once we do that we can come back at any time I believe so I'm gonna just kind of try and get through here without dying and uh, and then we'll come back and get the I know we missed at least one scout fly back there uh, so we'll do that okay reverse orbs Scout fly, don't blow up, don't blow up. Okay. Oh gosh, yeah, let's we're gonna leave that for now. Come back for it. Here we are. See ya! We did it! We them from Alright. Yes, and we'll get ourselves power orb cell power orb. There we go, perfect. Since I can't say precursor orb and power cell. You beat them to the detonator! The Red Sage's lab is just ahead. Go turn on the teleport gate so we can join you. All right, let's do that very quickly, and then we'll double back, and I want to go see if we can't clean up what we missed over here in the mountain pass. Um, volcanic crater. So, yeah, this is another... Basic, basically, you can view them as, like, lobbies for all the different sections of the, of the game. So the volcanic crater here is another lobby. Red Sage... We're a little over halfway through the game at this point. Um, okay, and turn the teleporter on. I always wonder if I'm losing body parts in those things. Holy yakow! The Red Sage's lab looks worse than the blues. Well, it definitely looks as though there's been a struggle here. <laughs> I'd hardly call it struggle. Would you, dear sister? Certainly not. The Red Sage gave up with so little effort. No fun at all. Gull? Is that you? You've finally gone off the deep end, eh? And Maya, I told you the Dark Eco would affect you both. Mm, nobody ever listens to old Samos. What have you two done with the Blue and Red Sages? Don't worry about your colorful friends, you old fool. They're perfectly safe in our citadel. Our special guests. They have graciously agreed to help us on a little project. You are wrong, Samos. Dark Eagle can be controlled. We've learned its secrets. And now we can reshape the world to our liking. You can't control Dark Eagle by itself. Even the precursors... Until now, do. we've had to scrape by with what little Dark Eco we could find near the surface. But soon, we will have access to the vast stores of Dark Eco hidden deep underground. Not the silos! Yes, the silos. They will be opened, and all the Dark Eco of the world will be ours! But that's impossible! Only a precursor robot... Oh, don't look so upset, Samos. We've got big plans for you. <laughs> Wait a minute! That was Gull? The same Gull who's supposed to change me back? Gull is the guy trying to kill us? I'm doomed. We may all be doomed. If they open the silos, the Dark Eco will twist and destroy everything it touches. We simply must get to their citadel to stop them. The fastest way there is through the lava tube at the bottom of this crater. A few more power cells and your Zoomer heat shield should get you across the lava safely. 
All right, my boy. You know what to do. Take the flea bag and go round up more power cells. All right, so uh, there we go. It turns out that Gaul, the master of Dark Eco, is the same who we ran into on Misty Island originally, uh, and who kind of is... Oh, it's an oracle. I was going to say, I saw a power cell down there. Um, and uh, so who kind of was responsible for... Actually, this is not the way we want to go. Um, but we'll grab these just over here. Um, who's kind of responsible for uh, Daxter's, Daxter's predicament in the first place. So, um, yeah. <laughs> a, bit of a, a bit of a twist there. Now not only are we just trying to get Daxter uh, restored, now we've got to save the world. So, uh, oh, not in the lava, please. Thank you. Okay, so, now, let's head back, and we want to go back into the mountain pass, and just try and do a little bit of cleanup there. I think we uh, probably missed quite a few things. Um, yeah, so we've got to get the scout flies, and then there's one other one that we missed as well. Now that we can get through here without the ticking clock, we can go ahead and pick that stuff up. I'm pretty sure we can get back all the way that we would need to. So let's go ahead and do that. Scout fly right here behind the detonator. All right. And... Let's see. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Boom. Okay. We've got enough to get all the Oracle's uh, stuff there. We'll have to get those on the way back. I think the other um, scout fly was out here outside of the caves. So we'll check there. Don't want any eco. Nope. I, I don't want any eco. There's that other power cell. We have the power cells back there. Um, there we go. Yeah, I don't really need boosts in this area. Just trying to stay alive. Okay, so <clears throat> now if we come out here. Uh, yeah, there it is. Beautiful. <clears throat> so we got those. Now, let's see, let's see how many Precursor Ores, we've got 42 of 50, I think we're probably okay, there is a, I think there's another little side path, okay, so I think there's a side path here, but there's also a vent here, so my guess is that we need to unlock unlock something and then we can come back and do that one so let's um let's just go ahead and head in here see if there's anything of interest uh, in the immediate volcanic crater uh, and then we'll go ahead and uh, probably call it a day I think we've had plenty of excitement uh, we fought the final not the final boss but we fought a boss um, and uh, learned that the big beds are the same people we're trying to seek help from so uh, we've got to help uh, help out Quite a bit. Save the world. That whole jazz. So, let's go ahead. Yes, 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 yes. Go ahead and just kill the engine. Thank you. Alright, so let's... Oh, right into the dark eco. <laughs> Whoops. And... We'll call it good. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Probably going to be a little bit of a shorter episode, but that's okay. Um, I've been Torn with the Grey, and you guys have been great. Um, well, no, let's. Uh, there was one area we can look at here. What am I doing? We, we can look at one little area here, and then we'll probably end up calling it a day, and we'll continue on uh, with this new section of the game next episode. I think there's one little thing up here that we could potentially do without going into a new section. There's a lot of stuff to do out. You know, you know. In fact, no. We're gonna call it good for today, guys. I think we've done enough. Uh, there's a lot to do out here, obviously. So we'll pick up with Volcanic Crater next episode, uh, and then we'll move on from there. But thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Torment the Great. You guys have been great. Make sure you leave those likes, comments, subscriptions for me, guys. I'll see y'all back here next time. Alrighty, guys. Have a good one. <laughs>